In this video, I'll be showing how I draw hair in Adobe Fresco. So usually, I only use the basic brush to draw everything including adding the shading and create the highlight in the hair. In Photoshop, I will still use the basic brush to lower the brush size down to a very small size to draw the hair stroke. But in Adobe Fresco, I'll choose fountain pen because it has the smallest brush size. I especially love the smoothing option when drawing the hair stroke. You can turn it up or turn it down as you need with any brush you choose. It's very helpful when you need to draw a curved line. Now I'm just doing the highlight and shading back and forth. I like to eye drop the skin color to create some more highlight. All the works in Adobe Fresco will be automatically saved as cloud documents. There's no layer limit. It also means you can open the files in Photoshop without AirDrop. Simply open your Adobe Creative Cloud and find your cloud documents in your computer. Okay, I think we're almost done with the hair. 